I mean, it'll say fucking. Uh, it says green. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, Obviously. just click. <laughs> I didn't think about that. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Damn, bro, I, I need your help reading this, red or green. <laughs> I, can't, I, can't I can't determine the difference. <laughs> My fucking color blindness, I can't read these colors. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Eloquent Dreams, the place where dreams are made. I hope you're having an amazing, fantastic day. And if you're not, me and Shinx are here to make it better. Uh, today, we actually got some coke carts for free. And if you guys haven't checked it out, if you go to Southern San Andreas, that is a it's the free card that we got for, I think we it was a billion, a, a billion dollars that everybody like the whole entire player base had to rob, and fuck me had to complete all the heist and get a billion dollars that's a, it, it was a hard sentence to get out so we won this and it's actually pretty yeah. entertaining uh but me and uh shinx are gonna be driving around and just chilling uh for this episode and probably end up doing some stunt races at the end so i hope you guys enjoy and i'll see you guys whenever something interesting is happening and i love you guys yeah you're keeping your phone hostage yeah you know look boy we caught you using this, sending dirty pictures. I don't want to see it happening again. I'll delete these pictures and make sure no one sees them for three hundred dollars. Damn it, Mr. Oaks! I saw them though. What would you do? I'm about to tell you a porno. What, I'm about no. to tell you a little bit of a porno right now. All right, well, hold up. What, what would you do if your teacher saw your news and, like... Oh, well, hold on. This is, where, this, is where we're, this is what this story is headed into, actually. <laughs> okay, so, Shep, here this goes. So I, I wasn't going to talk about this, but we're on this story of, like, self our teachers and phones. So, we're on this school field trip. Um... We're at a baseball game, and you know how there is like the. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Damn! I was reading text. Um. Hey, hey, whoa, whoa, this guy's flipping me off! No, he, he called you a cocksucker, man. Here, don't. Oh, I, I was just gonna rip him out and kick his ass, man. Are you gonna shoot me too? What are you doing, man? Chill out. Whoa. But anyway, going on. Um. I was talking to this female from the school at the time, her name was Paige. I'm just mentioning that okay. was perfectly in sync, but keep going. Yeah, I thought about that <laughs> in my head. Oh, it's okay. But anyways, going on, there was this girl, and she told the teacher she needed to go to the bathroom. So her and I were in an intimate relationship at this time. And so she goes to the bathroom. I was like, why the fuck? She she uh, she had never used the bathroom at school or like any field trips or shit like that. I had a text from my phone. And there behold, I got a Snapchat photo of her titty tits. Bro, the cops are uh, fucking me up on oh, my go on my little go kart. But keep going, yeah. Got a photo of her tits, and the teacher just happens to be on the seat right above me, so when I open the picture, my teacher sees the photo of the boobs. Well, like, what do you do so, as a teacher? Like, you can't tell anyone that you just saw some underage titties. Like, they're gonna, <laughs> they're gonna put you in jail. So here's, here's where this goes. We get back from the school field trip. It asks for us, like, in private. She was to sit home to our room in private after school. So, I already know where this is going. Now, the, the page doesn't know that she saw it. I knew she saw it. So, she goes in there, she was like, I saw the photo that you said it's, uh, Nick Finn. Now, I don't have, like, I'm not gonna, like, keep, I'm not gonna, like, tell on you guys for it, because obviously it's something, uh, private, but you guys need to know the location for her to do that, and not in public. And I... I started going off on her because that's kind of like an invasion of privacy looking at a student's phone. Uh, yeah, I agree. <sighs> so she said if I kept raising my voice, she was going to go and tell my parents. So I stopped raising my voice, went home, okay, told my parents okay, that I'll my girlfriend sent trouble. me a picture no of problem. her kids and my teacher was going to snitch. <laughs> Mom, call that teacher and pour her a new one. Ever 
ever since that day, that teacher never talked to me. Never talked to me. Ever she since that day. She was so embarrassed. That Just teacher so never embarrassed. has looked at a child's phone again. I never got called on. I never got called on nothing, dude. Yeah, but, like, what? it's so, like, you die so fast in, like, these cars that, like, have windows and shit like, like that because, like, yeah, they can shoot you easy. I'm sitting in an unprotected go-car and haven't died yet. Yeah. How is that possible? Uh, the engine, man. It's just covering your entire, like, spleen. I, 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 I guess so. It's yeah, the most I, important I get, part of your that. body. Your back. One shot. I don't want to be like Joe on Family Guy and get no. fucking paralyzed. Yeah, that was, I mean, yo, actually, that, good thing you brought that up, bro. Epic conversation real quick. Have you seen uh, Elon Musk's uh, Neuralink? What? Elon Musk, uh, you know who that is, obviously, right? Yeah, well, yeah, I know, of course. Well, have you heard of the Neuralink? No, I have not. It's N-E-U-R-O-L-I-N-K for anyone watching, if anybody wants to look it up. Um, but, uh, it's like this little microchip, and he's planning on putting it in, in, like, in your head, and it's gonna Bluetooth connect to your device, and, uh, he's already, like, testing it on pigs and stuff, and it works, like, perfectly fine. Um, obviously not for, like, reading information and stuff, they haven't tested that. But, um, what he says is, your eyes are, like, too slow to gather information, like, so, you know, like to read something off a piece of paper, you have to like look and read the whole entire thing. So he wants to put this little chip in your head that like connects to your phone. So if you want to look something up, it's like automatically in your head and you just like know all the information that was like on that paper, you know? So you, you could theory. Oh, and also it's like if anybody's crippled or anything, it can repair like keep. I, I, I heard from somebody else. Here, here's my point of view, and then I'll tell you what somebody else told me. Um, he said, I, I could have sworn that it was just, like, he puts it in your head, and, like, it repairs, like, nerves in your brain, and it automatically, like, you can walk and stuff again. But I heard somebody else tell me, which sounds more realistic, that he's going to put, like, these little discs or something in, like, like, if your knee or something was broken, he'll put a little disc that'll, like, Bluetooth connect to the little microchip that's in your head, which will theoretically, like, make you fucking Cyberpunk 27C7. <laughs> Uh, and you'll you'll be fucking uh, robot man. Uh, before before we die, I'm sure something that like we'll... that could go wrong. Uh, n yeah, I mean, there's two there's two sides, man. They could either go really good or go really bad. Like anyone who watches Star Wars, you know, Execute Order sixty six was put in. You you watch Star Wars, you know what Execute Order sixty six. I is actually new. never really watched Star Wars that much. I, as a, oh, okay. Yeah, as a kid, I was never brought up into it. Well, here, here's how this goes. There were just the good people, and they, they were clones, but at first, like, they're all the same people because they were used for wars. There was a clone put in, like, there was a chip put into their head at first, and they never knew what that was. It was actually, if Wait. someone said execute Order 66, it would turn them against the good guys that they were working with. It's hard to explain. You would have to. No, 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 no. I completely understand it. Are you, you, the white, the white robot dudes are the, or wait, are, are, what, who are you talking about? I know the stormtroopers are the white ones. The clones. Or, yeah, who, yeah, are the, yeah, who are the that's, clones? That's, yeah. that's the white people. Yeah. The, the okay, ones. so the one. <laughs> I, I didn't want to say white people because that just sounds stupid. Oh, here's the fucking course. Thank God. Uh, oh, press B on that if something pops up on your screen. Uh, so yeah, they're the clones, so they, they all had chips in the back of their head? Yeah, they all had chips, and when the war was about to be won, the bad guys said execute Order 66, which turned them against the yeah, Jedi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. So, that's basically something Elon Musk could do, put something like a chip in the head and then fucking just turn everyone against each other, turn into the purge, basically. Bro, can we just mention how amazing this car is being right now? Have, like, I don't know if you've followed me completely, but this is awesome. And, yeah, I, I completely agree. Yeah, somebody could also, like, hack and, like, fuck you yeah, up. Yeah, anyone could hack it and just cause some wreck. It would take years and years. I feel like Elon Musk is, like, going to be, like, on. he can't die. There has to be, like, something that, like, keeps 
him alive. He's yeah, like, he's definitely he's not. He's definitely generation. not a human, man. Oh, there, there's something not humanly right. This I mean, guy. who the fuck just gives some random man like ability to like build rocket ships and shit? Like we haven't gone and to these, the moon. Like, self-driving cars. Like and, and building tunnels underneath Los Angeles, like. He's not just some man, like, I don't know, man, he, he's pretty special in some type of way. Yeah, there's some something going on that we don't know about. Yo, dog, I'm fucked up, help me. Uh, he must be one of those, uh, aliens from, uh, Mars. I'm thinking, uh, I was thinking more of, like, uh, what do you, what do you call it? Oh, the fucking lizard people. Appreciate it. Like fucking uh, Mark Zuckerberg. Yeah, Mar <laughs> dude, Mark Zuckerberg is definitely a lizard person. He he's the weirdest person <laughs> no, I've no, ever seen. No, no, he is the lizard person. He, he is the lizard king. <laughs> Probably no, I don't There's know. There's a man. skate park by the casino. Why don't we just go to that? We can. Uh, I, I thought this was like a Mario Kart course. Is it not? I don't know, man. I would rather, like, have, you've watched Sword Art Online, obviously, because your uh, profile picture is cutie toe. So, uh, like, what, what do you think about, like, before you die, like, just putting your mind into, like, a video game? And then, like, they just keep your brain alive, like, in, like, Futurama, you know, they put the brains in the little water tanks. And then, like, they keep your um, brain alive and keep you in the video okay, game. Okay, so that's an interesting question that, um, you're asking me right now. <laughs> um... <laughs> <laughs> it is an interesting question. So, right, so, by the time that something like that is actually possible... I, I think it'll be possible by the time we die. Like, you, you have really no idea how fast, like, technology is evolving. It doubles, like, every single... It, it just keeps doubling. No, I'm saying that I... We, I'm hoping we're still put into a cop to put underground because if we're all kept in a fucking hospital, it's just gonna clutter that earth and cause the ozone to absolutely fucking get demolished. Wait, we're what? all gonna die anyways. Wait, wait I'm, I'm sorry. But... I think we should all just naturally die is what I'm trying to say. Oh, you don't think? I, uh, like, I don't think we should be like past our time span. Unless, like, I'm saying we can still get buried, put in a coffin, and still have this chip that keeps us in a video game, then I'm all for it. That would be, but I didn't think about that. No, I, I was thinking about one. just putting your brain, like, think about it, look. So it's like this big, deep, like, big, deep drill hole in the ground. And all it is is, like, just on multiple layers of just, like, little tanks with people's brains in it. And it just slides down into the earth, and like you just can't okay, see it. Well, so yeah, if a nu it. if a nuclear bomb would yeah. offer something, you'd be like your memory and all that would be straight, and like you would. Okay, yeah. then yeah, I'm down with that. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I just said it like that, and I'm down yeah, with yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. Like, and then if something went wrong, it would just pause you, and so like they fixed it, and then you would come back on. I wish. Um, I wish there was a way. Like, you know the Walt Disney shit, they're Hold saying up. that, uh... Let me, let me pause you real quick. Um, viewers, if you guys have, uh, like, Amazon Prime, make sure you guys watch this series called Upload. It's pretty good. It's pretty much exactly what I was just talking about, but go ahead. I don't know what I was fucking talking about. You were talking about, um... Uh, Walt Disney, Disney. Yeah, yeah, Walt. So, people say he's frozen and stuff. I wish it was possible. Like, realistically, obviously he's not frozen, but you don't know I him. wish there was a way to actually be frozen. I would love to, right now, to uh, get frozen and wake up 100 years from now. To what, like, fucking cry? Involved. Yeah, that's what someone in the chat said. What is it? Is he writing poems? Someone asked if the show, someone asked if the show upload is good. Oh, if the show upload is good, it actually, I, I personally really, really loved it. It was, uh, it was funny. It's, um, it's, it's super different, bro. Like, I promise you, if you watch it, you'll, you'll enjoy it. it it's like, it, it's, it, it's really well done. 10 out of 10. In okay, so, uh, uh, maybe uh, a eight and a half out of 10. Yeah, it got me into Rainbow Six Siege. Oh, I hated Rainbow. Oh, man, I'm gonna. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna piss somebody off saying that. 
Uh, You're gonna oh. piss me off. <laughs> <laughs> I personally, I'm I'm just not like, I'm not skilled at those types of games, man. I'm not skilled at Call of Duty on the fucking. Uh, I was skilled at Black Ops too. That was the only game I was good at, but. It was um, just uh, can, uh, can, can you join? We're about to do some races, so, um... I mean... If you're in a racist, you can join. Yeah, sure. I mean, I'm, I'm down for new people, always. As long as you have a good attitude and you're not... Fuck, uh, don't be... Yeah, yeah no, you no, can't be... Shit, no, yeah, no, uh, cursing. Or, well, I mean, you can curse, obviously. Well, yeah, you can no, curse, no, but... You know what I fucking like that mean, you bastards. Shit. Yeah, like... <laughs> I ranked up, let's go. You're only a fucking level 74. I shut the fuck up. Dude, look, you're actually pretty much worthless compared to me. I'm level 293. Yeah, man, I'm about to say that I'm using the custom Duke of Death. Yeah, so am I. Did you choose your custom outfit or no? No, you didn't, you fucking idiot. I look like a dumbass now. <laughs> <laughs> you really do. <laughs> I look out of place, man. They probably think I'm like seven years old. I, I look like I'm about to play on my Game Boy Advance. My dick's pretty long, buddy. Uh, yeah, no, nah, I don't slide that way. I, I meant like <laughs> the dedication would be pretty impressive that you came that far. <laughs> but I'd still tell you now to do it. if I drove all that way? Uh, I mean, if you drove, I was thinking, like, if you walked. Like, if you walked, I'd be high. I might, like, let you inside and, like, be like, damn, bro, you really did that? But, like, if you drove there, I would kind of be like, I mean, anyone can drive that car, dog. <laughs> I don't fucking know. <laughs> How long will Twitch be streaming? How long will you be streaming on Twitch? Oh, how long will today's stream be, bro? Oh, I've already, I've already played for like over an hour. Yeah, well, I mean. So it's probably, yeah, like, this is like after we're done racing, now it's, uh. Yeah, we, we I'll probably fuck for... around on free roam. Yeah, we can stream yeah, for a minute. Around, but, but this video won't be, uh. This oh, video I, I will don't be have... ended, but I'll still be live. What, wait, I'm sorry, go ahead. No, I was saying that your video will be over. Oh yeah, I won't edit that until we're completely done streaming and all that, and it'll be up like later on today at like 12 or so. So after, uh, yeah, after the fucking uh, uh, video is done recording, it's just gonna be us vibing, man. Should be a good time. No, if I heard you right, man, that's a pretty massive doogie. I, you, you didn't say anything after that, and uh, I didn't like the last words that came out of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't kind of let it sit there with you. I, I didn't like it sitting there. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll put him like in a world pipe, coming through the fucking uh, like a little, you know, the little green pipe. He'll be coming out at the bottom of the screen. <laughs> Yo, did that asshole really just do that to me? What a fucking cunt. What an absolute cunt. I'll probably lose this race completely. I'm in 16th place right now, Mr. Roger. Have, did you ever watch Mr. Roger? You're not fucking talking, yeah, Mr. bro. Roger, yeah. Mr. Rogers was filmed by me. Of course I fucking know. You filmed Mr. Rogers? No, it was filmed by me, like in my town. Oh. I was like, damn, bro, how old were you? Um, yeah, you used to, so you, did you ever, like, see him in person, or, uh, no? I don't know, when did he pass away? Uh, he was, I was still a little kid when he passed away. So. Yeah, I, I didn't know if, like, he was, if he died in the 90s, or if he passed, like, in the early 2000s. I, well, I'm pretty sure it was the early 2000s. Rest in peace. I, I'm pretty sure I was alive. Yeah, I, I, I don't know, I, I do remember watching uh, his stuff whenever I was a kid though. I, I don't know if I liked it so much, but I did watch it. I liked, uh... I really just fucked someone up. I watched some, but he, he taught me how to brush my teeth or some shit. I don't remember. <laughs> he didn't, like, actually fucking teach me. It's not like I was like, how the fuck do I hold this toothbrush? But he was like, these are called the bristles. And, like, he was, I don't know, 
He was a good guy, <laughs> Mr. Rogers, that man. Have you yeah, seen I the new it. movie? That, that was it. Did you see the movie? The movie? Uh, the Mr. Rogers movie. It has Tom Hanks no, I, playing him. It. It's really good too. It's kind of sad. And Christopher Robin, which was like Winnie the Pooh, but nowadays, and the dude's like a businessman. And he's like, what fuck you. What you uh, Seventh or some shit. And like, he's Christopher Robin, like the kid that owned Winnie the Pooh. He's like a businessman now, and he's like, fuck you, Winnie. Like, you're pretty much like for children. Get the fuck out of here, you magical piece of shit. And like, which doesn't make sense. Doing... Oh, this is so <laughs> stupid. All right. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys did, make sure to smash the like button. Comment down below what you guys want to see next. And subscribe for more videos by me and my best friend Shinx over here. Um, other than that, uh, I don't have very much planned for the future. So, like I said, if you comment down below what you guys want to see me play, I more than likely will, will end up playing it. So, yeah. As always, everybody be safe. And I love all of you guys. Goodbye.